Hi friends, in this video we see about some objective type questions. The first question is nuclear fission can be explained by. Here there are four options shell model, liquid drop model, quark model and then bore atom model. So the answer is B liquid drop model. Okay, so liquid drop uh, mean liquid drop model the nuclear considered as a liquid drop. Okay, that means a liquid has uh, a liquid drop has a yeah, spherical shape due to surface tension. On applying external force, these spheres changes into ellipsoid, which may change into tumble shape when the force is larger. Okay, so when we apply the force, uh, the liquid drop um, uh, has a sp a sphere can be converted into ellipsoid then the ellipsoid shape uh, change into tumble shape then we apply the large amount of force that tumble shape breaks into two parts okay so this is similar to the nuclear fission so nuclear fission means that is a heavier atom break into lighter part lighter atom isn't it so that means um, in uh, okay okay so there in the same way when the heavier nucleus absorbs a neutron, a common nucleus is formed and is left in an excited state. The excitation energy set up a series of rapid oscillation. The common nucleus undergoing distortion from spherical to tumble shape. Each portion of the tumble shape has a positive charge. So they ripple each other. Okay, so that same charge, the same charge ripple each other. This result is vision. That is, uh, the, that is, uh, and this is similar to the fission reaction. Okay. So, the nuclear fission can be explained by the liquid drop model. Okay. So, the answer is B. So, the next question is, the average energy released per fission is. So, the answer is B, 200 million electron volt. The next question is, the exp explosion of atom bomb is based on the principle of. So, the atom bomb is the uh, example for fission reaction. Then, uh, it is also, um, uh, it is the, it is uncontrolled fission reaction. Okay. So, the uh, neutron, the form neutrons are multiply indefinitely. Okay. So, that is uh, uncontrolled fission reaction. And the answer is A. So, the next question is, in the nuclear reaction, HG 198AT, plus X gives AU198979 plus H11 that is mercury is um, uh, that uh, mercury is uh, react with the element the unknown element X then it gives the AU cold 198.79 and uh, hydrogen H11 okay so that uh, what is X here what is X okay so uh, first you check here uh, in the uh, in the mass number 198 here 198 plus 1 ok so the 191 so the x must have in the upper number 1 ok so in the lower number here 80 then here 79 in this side 79 plus 1 so 80 here uh, 80 so that is equal so the x uh, has upper value 0 ok so the answer is neutron so uh, neutron is uh, neutron symbol is 0 n 1 okay so that is the answer c next question is the binding energy of ion 5626 nucleus is okay so the binding energy means in a nucleus the proton and the neutrons are joined okay so uh, some mass is disappear this mass converted into energy that energy is called the binding energy Okay, so the binding energy of uh, ion nucleus is 8.8 uh, .8 million electron volt that is uh, answer is A. Okay, so the next one is the liquid drop model was explained by um, here the answer is D that is Bohr and John A. Wheeler both B and C. Okay, Bohr and John A. Wheeler explained the liquid drop model. Okay, so the next question is which is true regarding photon? So, photon, no charge and no mass, carries energy, travel with velocity of light, all of this. So, here the answer is D. Uh, the photon has no charge, no mass, 
and it carries some energy and it travels with the velocity of light. Okay. So the next one is the number of neutrons released during uranium 235 fission is. Okay. So in the fission reaction, uh, when the new uh, when the uranium uh, bombard with the uh, neutron, it emits uh, uh, it breaks into lighter particle and it also emits the three neutrons okay so that three neutrons further react and it multiplied okay three is converted into nine and nine is converted into 27 so the uh, neutron released in the fission reaction is three the answer is b okay so the next question for chain reaction to be continued the multiplication factor k is okay so um, the uh, so the here the answer is b that is k, uh, k greater than 1 okay so the k, k must be greater than 1 okay so uh, the k chain reaction to be continued otherwise uh, it uh, it not continued okay so the next one is radioactivity is due to radioactivity is due to the unstable nucleus that is the answer is a so unstable nucleus means it is a heavier atom okay so the heavier atom emits the or the unstable nucleus emits the um, radio uh, radiation okay so your alpha beta rays gamma rays okay so uh, the answer is a radioactivity is due to the unstable nucleus the next one is which is determined by the pain bridge mass spectrometer okay so the pain bridge mass spectrometer is uh, used to detect the or determine the atomic mass the answer is b okay so next one is what is the name of the reactor at trombe okay name, name of the nuclear reactor at trombe so the answer is uh, c apsara okay so the apsara reactor in trombe then kamini is in tamil nadu okay so the answer uh, the d option d kamini is in the tamil nadu okay so the next one is radioactivity may be so uh, uh, options are natural artificial natural and artificial and none okay so the radioactivity may be caused by natural and artificial okay so the here the answer is c okay so the next question is the unit of radioactivity is okay so the unit of radioactivity is pecurel here, uh, here uh, pecurel is the name of uh, scientist henry pecurel okay so the unit of radioactivity is pecurel so next question is the example for electrostatic accelerator is so the electrostatic accelerator is the answer is both a and b okay so uh, in which uh, the electrostatic accelerator means the charged particles are accelerated by applying a constant potential difference okay that is called the electrostatic accelerator the answer is uh, von de Kraft generated and Cockcroft Walton generator. Okay, so the answer is D. So the next one is nuclear fusion reaction takes place spontaneously in. Okay, so the nuclear fusion fusion means that is lighter particle joined and it forms a heavier nucleus. Okay, so the uh, so uh, this reaction takes place in the atmosphere of the sun. Okay, so the answer is C. Next question is the energy of the thermoneutron is so thermoneutron uh, is um, uh, is related to the fusion reaction okay so the energy of the thermoneutron is uh, answer is b that is 0.025 electron volt okay so uh, that's all friends thank you